In today's video, we're going to see how to create KDP coloring books for kids, just like all these other people are doing. You can see that they sell really well. For example, in the past month, this book has been sold over 1000 times. It doesn't have a lot of reviews though, but it's just because people just don't leave a review after purchase. Like it's like less than 50%. But since I use BookBolt, I can easily find the BSR for this book and it's 106. And if you go to another tool and type in that BSR rank, as you can see, you can see that they've got 9,000 sales per month. So in a day, they sell this 625 times. If you multiply that with the price, you will get how much money they make. Now I'm showing you all of this just for you to know that this is a profitable niche still. It is competitive, but of course, you will just use the SEO in order to create these pages, these books. You can see when I just type in coloring books in the search bar on Amazon, I will get over 80,000 results. But here's a little trick for you to know. If you just type in coloring books and hit the enter key, you will get what people are searching for. All right, so these are all the terms that people are searching for. So what do we have to do now? We have to go and we have to make an answer to those search results, all right? So for example, if you head over and click on for kids ages four to eight, you will get far less results. So over 30,000 results. And of course, now is the time for research. You can see, you can just make the title Cute Cats Coloring Books for Kids Ages 4 to 8 because that's what parents are searching for. And that is the trick for you to get more traction. Now you can see it's all about dinosaurs, animals, cars, you know, these like cartoon things, mermaids, you know, for girls and you now Halloween. So that is the thing that you have to do the research for. This way you will just know what to make. All right. You can make tons of coloring books and you just have to know the category, the niche. So let's actually start with creating. In this video, I will show you how to create the interior of the book. Then we're going to move on to the cover of the book, which is really important. And of course, uploading all of that to KDP. Now, we are going to use artificial intelligence and I'm using mid journey, but you have to pay for it. I'm using this one basic plan, which is $10 per month. And I really like this one and it's good for me. But of course, there are free variants that you can use just by using another AI image tool. One more reason because I use mid journey is this one. So you have general commercial terms. That means you can sell it anywhere. But of course, these free ones will give you that as well. Just mid journey is by bit better. Not a lot, but it's just easier for me. If you want, you can use Leonardo.ai or maybe bluewillow.ai. Whichever one you choose, you can just go and play with it and you will just get more proficient with more experience by using the prompts. All right, so let's actually go with Leonardo. Create yourself an account on Leonardo. Click on start using Leonardo. Go to yes, I'm wildlisted and you will land on the front page where you can just see a lot of these recent creations that a lot of people did. Now we have to search for the models. That's one more reason why I don't like using free tools because they have like these models. Sometimes it's good, but on mid journey, I can just write the prompt and it just uses like the generic model. On Leonardo, you have to use this. Head over to AI image generation and then just use this Leonardo diffusion. That is good for coloring pages. As you can see, I've made some of these and you've got a lot of these models. You can just play with these and I don't know, maybe I can just show you with RPG five or maybe Dream Shaper version six, how the same prompt will go. Now this you can use in mid journey as well. So firstly, you will just specify what it is. So coloring page for kits. That is the first part of your prompt. The next part is going to be that research that you did. So what do you want to make? Do you want to make an animal? Do you want to make a dinosaur? Do you want to make a car? The next part is I want it to be cartoon style. And of course, I want it to be low detail because you don't need highly detailed pictures in order for kits to color. And of course, this is really important. No shading. All right, we don't need shades. All of these AI tools, they just want to put the shades to look better. All right, but that is for another purpose. We don't need shades here because little kids are going to color those, right? So this one was created with Leonardo Diffusion, the regular one. 
Now, let me just show you what happens if I choose this Dream Shaper. I'm just going to click on the Generate button here. And of course, in a few seconds, you will get this. So it is not coloring book at all. This down there is a coloring book. It's a little koala on the tree. So what you can do now, click on the download image button and it's going to go over to your computer, right? Now, the next step, we need to use canva.com. And I always use this one. I just like Canva. For this purpose, it's free. You don't have to pay for it unless you want to use some of these like templates that they've got, which are pretty good, by the way. You can start with Canva only. But today I've decided to make this with AI tools. I'm going to show you some of these templates, but AI tools is something that I like better nowadays, you know. So the book that we want to create has to be 8.5 by 11 inches all right but there is something which is called bleeding you know so those are like little margins little edges on these pages so we have to increase it just a bit so what i want you to do is to click over to custom size here on this button and then type in 8.625 and here 11.25 so in a nutshell this is going to be 8.5 by 11 inches you have to specify the inches here as well do not forget that and then just increase the size a bit and then click on create new design now you are going to be inside of your dashboard where you will just upload all of those ai image generated coloring pages all right now my suggestion is to get like at least 10 20 30 40 all right so because you want to make a big coloring book because parents would just like to get more you know that's how it works but I told you that I'm just gonna show you some of these coloring books or coloring pages on Canva that are already there so you can see they've got a lot of these and this is good for our last step and I'm gonna talk about that later so now in order to upload that in order to make the interior click on the upload here and now you just upload your designs that you have created. Now, when it's done, you just move that like this until it fits the whole page, as you can see, and you can resize it. You can move it all around. You can just, for example, move it like this, like this, like this until it fits the page. So it's only one page now. And of course we need more. So in order to do that, click on the plus icon here and then add another one. The process is of course, same for all of these. Make the picture, in the AI image tool and then just upload it here. And it's nothing special. Anyone can do this. Just move this, drag and drop those pictures until you get the desired number of pages. But the next step is one that I like really, really much. I mean, you can design these pages, but the cover is really important and fun to make. First of all, go to Kindle Direct Publishing Cover Calculator because they have cover calculator for you. And all you gotta do is to enter your book information. So this is gonna be paperback. Interior type is gonna be black and white, of course. Paper type is gonna be regular white paper. Page turn direction, left to right, of course. Measurement units, inches. And of course, just select that one that we have chosen. So this is one, 8.5 by 11 inches choose that enter your number of pages whatever you decided i just put 40 click on calculate dimensions and you will get the template for the cover this is really important all right amazon after all is going to print this out so you have to adhere to their standards all right they will send you this and you will get a file even when you click on this button which is download template you will get a zip file and in that zip file it's going to be this all right so this is your cover but the left hand side it's the back of your book while the right hand side it is the front all right now we have to make the custom size for the cover as well change this to inches and then just read this time you look at these overall dimensions all right so it's going to be 17.340 you can just paste that in here take this second one paste that one as well create new design and then of course just upload that pdf or png now what we have to do we have to move this as well it's going to fit the screen right because we have just chosen these dimensions and now as i've told you this is the back side this is the front side and on the back side we have to just make it black so just go to elements here click on one of these shapes for example this one it's going to be good this square 
move it here and then just I want to make it black click here click on the black color to choose black color and then I just want to place it here I like to place it like this and then I just have to move this I want to make this to cover all of this but this is really important I'm just going to increase like the size of this so you see these dotted lines that is like the edge, the spine, where the book folds, all right? So this is what you want to do. You want to move this black to the second one here, all right? So this is where it will collapse. And now this part is done. I'm just going to unzoom this now so you can see. And the next step is, of course, to make this front page. Now, for that front side, I've just used like book covers, or you can as well use artificial intelligence to create the cover as well. But I usually find something like this on Canva and it is job done for me. You know, I just changed the text here. So it's going to be like wildlife coloring book. And you get a lot of these like similar suggestions and they can all work. If not all, most of them can work in order to create yourself like a coloring book. For example, this one, Animal Story, you just make like animal coloring book and it's going to work out for the kids and for their parents, you know. So this is the one way, of course, but you can always use AI tool in order to generate the cover as well. For example, this can be the cover if you just make it look nicer, you know. So just play with AI tool. You can get a lot of things or just use these Canva templates, which are really great. And then, of course, the last step for you is to create yourself KDP account and then start uploading those books. One more tool that I use, I've told you BookBolt, you have a studio inside of it and it can help you with the research keywords. But that's maybe down the line when you just get through this beginner phase, you know, just get a lot of experience and then you will see what you miss, how you can proceed and how to scale this one. It's not hard, but you have to work hard for it. All right. So I wish you good luck. Make those books and make a lot of money. I'll catch you.